All right, so this video here is just in case you missed this interaction between Judge Janine and Geraldo on Fox the Five. They're talking about the fact that Vladimir Putin did not, did not invade Ukraine during the Trump administration. He did it during the Biden presidency. So let's go ahead and, and uh, watch this clip. I want you to think about something for a second. Democrats told us for the past four or five years that Donald Trump was a Russian asset. Donald Trump was a Russian spy. Vladimir Putin was his boss. So how come Vladimir Putin didn't invade during the Trump presidency? Think about that. Anyway, let's do this. Let me know what you think about in the comment section. Let's go. Help President Trump that much, okay? But I tell you right now that he didn't do it when Trump was president mm -hmm. because he knew that Donald Trump would come in if you touch one hair on one innocent civilian, he wouldn't care NATO or non-NATO. And don't tell me that Putin isn't afraid of someone. Biden is responsible for the decline of the West. What we are seeing right now is a, I can't say the word, is a wuss. We've got a bully in the, in, the, in the yard, in the playground yard, in the schoolyard, and everybody's back at the fence. That's a fact. I posted a video the other day. Somebody said, Donald Trump, this should be taught in school, actually. Donald Trump is that type of person. You don't know what to expect from them, so you just don't mess with them, just in case, because you don't know what you're going to get with them, right, from them. Um, the rest of the world leaders, all those world leaders, then knew not to mess with Donald Trump, and they respected him from that. They were a little bit afraid of him, I have to say, right? So what Judge Janine is saying here is... Uh, it's factual. And now what's happening? We have a bully and the United States was supposed to be the police of the world is nowhere to be found. You're supposed to stop this. And Vladimir Putin knows this. He knows Joe Biden is not going to do anything. So he, go, he just goes around and do his own thing. A lot of people right now are talking about sanction, sanction, sanction on oil. Just because the United States doesn't buy Russian oil, do you think Russia really care about it? Bro, Almost all those European countries are still buying Russian oil at a higher price. All right? Just think about that. So, anyway, let's keep going here. All right? How do you know? All we, wait a minute. Let me finish. All we have to do is we have enough oil in Canada, the United States, and Mexico. And we could be our own superpowers. But right now, the Biden administration is not only hurting the Americans and all this hashtag blame Putin TikTok <laughs> nonsense. <laughs> all this is crap. All he has to do is turn to America and let us be the strength. That's another fact. On the uh, Donald Trump, we were energy independent. The first week or the first month of the Biden uh, administration, they signed what? 45, 46 executive action, basically overturning everything Trump did. Now, what are the consequences? Energy independence, gone. The border, a mess. The economy, trash. War around the world. We have Afghanistan. I don't even want to think about Afghanistan. Now we have Russia. And they're not even telling you what's happening in Libya and in Africa. All right. Because your eyes are just focused on Europe, bro. And then the crime. Look at all those Democrat run city and how high the crime is. They are destroying this country, bro. I can't wait for 2024 for somebody to come and fix this. Whoever it is, bro. It's going to be better than this. I pray to God. So let's keep going here. And he is you know, destroying the West. How do you know that Putin wasn't playing Trump? How do you know? When, oh, stop when you he wasn't he was, playing Trump. When, when Trump. He didn't Trump invade was, was Trump I, was I love Trump. I love it's Trump not about loving I, Trump. It, it's about the fact that Trump had everybody against the wall. How do you know that don't think Putin it was didn't think Trump different. would give him I don't Ukraine give a anyway. damn what Putin thinks. I only care what Putin did. And he was a, a wuss when Trump was president. That is something that should be taught in school also. I don't care what Putin thinks. I care what he did. Don't pay attention to what people are saying, especially people like Democrats. They're just liars. They'll come on TV. They'll tell, I'll do this for you. I'll protect you against this. I'll do that for you. I'll give you that money, bro. Watch how people act. Watch their action. For example, the government is telling you every day how they're here to help you. Um, the price of gas is going super high. People are hurting. And then what are they doing? They just sent 13, 14 billion dollars to Ukraine. 
And don't get me wrong, I feel for them. It's very sad what's happening there. But think about it also. This is a war created by government. Citizens have nothing to do with this. Russian citizen, Ukraine citizen, American citizen, we just people, we want to go, you know, work our job, uh, eight to five or whatever job you're working, take care of your family, and that's it. But government, they're the one doing whatever they're doing up there and creating wars, all right? So I blame the government all the time. But what Jen, uh, Judge Janine here said is, uh, that's factual. I don't care what Putin thinks, I care what he did. So I don't care what he said. What I know is he did not invade during the Trump presidency. He invaded Ukraine during the Biden presidency. Let me know what you think about this. And um, God bless you. See you on the next one. That's the end of it. There you go. <laughs> that might be my favorite conversation of this whole year.